I don't know a single person who hasn't personally been touched by someone who deals with anxiety or depression. How many kids that we don't know about are struggling? We gotta get those kids, we gotta get to them. Sometimes making friends is hard. You're always scared of rejection. And I was kind of an introverted person, and so I always had a little bit difficulty socializing. Our goal is to help local kids to find friends. And the way that we're doing that is to have teen leaders facilitate some community service events. Depression and anxiety were a lot more prominent in high school than they were in middle school. So I knew immediately that it was something that I wanted to help with. My hope is that kids can just realize the value of a friend, where they can realize that, you know, everyone's just like me um, and that we're all looking for connection. Everyone deserves a friend and helping them to find that friend would be something great. I can do that. We can do that. We wouldn't be able to do what we do, make an impact for the kids that we do, if we didn't work with a foundation. Most of our kids come into the program because they need someone with a positive role model in their life. They need someone to come in and it's going to spend an hour focusing just on them. And it validates them, it makes the kids feel important. Every kid needs that. I know this because I was one of those kids growing up. I had people in my life that made a difference and that's why this program is so important to me and I know it makes a difference in the community. When I see lunch buddies going down the hall and I see happy smiling faces and kids having fun, that makes me feel good. Pantry Packs is not just about food. There's the anxiety of not eating, not knowing when your next meal is. We're there to help you. We're not judging you. We're just giving you some food to help you get through the weekend. The support of the Lake Washington Schools Foundation for the Pantry Packs program has been essential in giving us stability and the ability to plan ahead so that we're always going to be able to meet the needs of the students in our school district. It makes those students feel like somebody cares and is looking out for them. And we know that we're helping them have a better start in life. This has impacted everyone in our district. We've, we've all known of, of kids, you know, family members, people we know and love that have suffered and maybe have um, passed away you know, by suicide. And I think our kids are experiencing things very differently than we did, which is uh, putting a lot more pressure on them academically and socially. They are looking for a compassionate person to listen to their struggle, what's happening, so that they can get help. And it is our duty as that safe adult that they've confided in to get them that help. We really need as much information and training as possible right now. I'm glad I took the class. I learned a lot. I've been less afraid to step up and ask questions and be there. Um, you know, my kid thought it was lame. <laughs> Why are you doing that? But yet, my child has directed other kids to say, you should talk to my mom. She can get help. Saving kids. That's it. The bottom line. People need to step up. Why not me? I'm Kim Estes. I am Victoria Getsy Nelson. I'm Janice wilson Vache. I'm Stephanie. My name is Hannah. My name is Kimberly Frutel. My name is Laura, and I make a difference. And I make a difference. And I make a difference. And I make a difference with the Lake Washington Schools Foundation. With the Lake Washington Schools Foundation. With Lake Washington Schools Foundation. With Lake Washington Schools Foundation.